with the Invasion jailbreak for your iPhone 3GS, iPhone 4, 4S, iPhone 5, iPad 3rd, 4th gen, anything that is pretty much, apart from the iPhone 3G, anything that is running iOS 6.0, 6.1. So my device is here and I also got screen record. So what you need to do is click on this up here on Mac OS X. If you're on Mac, you've got Linux or Windows, and then it will come to a link and that will give you this here. So what you need to do now, it says Welcome Evasion is an untethered jailbreak for iOS 6.0 through 6.1. iPhone 4S, that's what I've got uh, installed. So all I need to do now is click Jailbreak and we'll just let it jailbreak and I will come back to you once it has finished going across. So there we go guys, right, it's now telling me to welcome to, uh, to continue, please unlock your device and tap the new jailbreak icon. So there is the new jailbreak icon, just there. Uh, so I need to tap that and the screen will go black and return to the home screen. So I've tapped it. All right, injecting remount payload. So it shouldn't be long and the jailbreak will be done. Jailbreak complete, the device may restart a few times as it completes the process. So there we go guys, this is just the untethered jailbreak that Invasion have done. Um, or invaders um, have called the jailbreak invasion. So uh, we should have a jailbreak on all our devices now from the 3GS upwards, as long as it's running iOS 6.0 or 6.1. Jailbreak complete, device may restart a few times. All right, there we go. Setting up studio packages, rebooting. So on screen now I should be able to exit, but I will wait until it is completely authorized. But we've got to remember guys, make, make sure your iOS device is plugged in to the computer. Continuing boot. And then we will have um, our jailbreak. So hopefully you liked this um, video guys, uh, this kind of tutorial. If you would like to hit the subscribe button, that would really help me out and thumbs up the video. Um, right, now hopefully we will unlock the device. And there is Cydia. There it is. Oh, I do have, do not. So there we go guys, Cydia has just now rebooted. So I'll just click on it. And there we go, we will go as user. 